peace. What it was, is, and will be. You know who it is, and the monks are in the temple. If you want to be here with us, all you got to do is hit that subscribe button. You can like, unlike, leave a comment. When you hit the button, you become a part of the family, and you become a subscriber. You become a monk. It's that simple. And if you have any requests, suggestions, or information regarding any of the groups that we review here, all you got to do is hit it up. Temple of the monk at gmail.com. That's monk with a Q. Temple of the monk at gmail.com. Monk with the Q. And don't forget, you want to sign up. Website link is in the description below. We got forums and chat rooms. And if you would like to support this channel any further than you're currently doing by subscribing, we have a Patreon link down there as well. EXO, the teasers. I'm told that these are supposed to be on deck, 23 of them. I'm gonna give you one half now, one half later, because I want you to save it a moment like I do. Okay, now I don't know what to expect from the teasers other than I heard they were, I believe, promotional? It just says EXO teasers and it looks like Kai is in one. From the information I was giving, he, given, Kai was, because Kai was the first dancer, he was in most of them, so. I'm excited to see what this is like. So if you're ready, I'm ready. Let's do it. Kaja. So we're going to check out the EXO teasers. I've been asked several times, have you seen the teasers? Have said absolutely not. I'm not going to lie. At first I thought, why? Why watch the teasers when I could just watch? But these teasers seem to have an element in it that you do not see in any of the MVs. And I think they showcase the dancer, uh, they showcase the members differently than you would see in an MV. And so these teasers um, are, I, 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 if I'm correct, and correct me if I'm wrong, really have nothing to do with they really have nothing to do with the MVs as much as they do the group. Is is that what these are about? Because I don't see anything pertaining to any of the MVs in the thumbnails of these. They look like something totally different, like almost like movie trail teasers. So I'm gonna check them out. The first 13 of these, we may I may stop in between. You never know. I'm just I'm I'm curious as to see what's about to go down. 23 of them. This one's about a minute 48, so I think that's about an average time, give or take, for each video. So that's why we're gonna go through so many at once because if they're that short, I'm not gonna do one video for one teaser. That's insane. All right, so let's do it. And this, this is Kai with the old school Cadillac even. Let me take these off. He came out like a mobster. This is like Godfather shit right here. Well, yeah, a little. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, wait, how old was he here? He looks crazy young. Oh yeah, this must be what, several years back? Maybe five, seven years? First of all, you got first of all, you got my man Kai dancing, who's one of my favorite dancers in the group, and you got my boy Do Do singing? Get the frick. She's my baby. Get out of here. Oh my god. Uh, some of these, I wonder the, I wanna I, I need to find something. Kren, I wanna know if there's anything with the choreographers. This, that's who I wanna see. I wanna see the guys who put this together, if it's not the group putting it together, which is still fascinating. I wanna see who the choreographer, if we have anything on the choreographers, please let me know, okay? She's my baby. Say hi, 
that he did like you I used to think when watching this that eh, that's nothing like it's just you moving your body in, in all different places like anybody can do that that used to be my way of thinking with this type of dance and I don't know if this was considered like jazz contemporary or what the name for it is um, I would call it time to, I think it, I would call it maybe jazz contemporary I don't know am I wrong but um, if I if we look at the movements in here the angles, like the leg angles, the arm angles, everything is like the angles are precise. The leg angle with the knee is precise. Each movement is very like on point and delicate. It's like, it's. Grab. You see what I'm saying though? Like the way everything is put together is just really, really precise. Official homepage, YouTube channel, and Facebook for EXO. Kai and Luhan. are fluent from say something smooth to something sharp right yeah. <laughs> Luhan I don't know if I paid too much to attention to Luhan as a, as the dancers I've always focused on and and this has been said that a lot of focus is on XOL as it is, uh, XOL, XOK than it is XOM. I noticed XOM only because you guys kept telling me, yo, you got to remember, remember to watch K and M. There's two sides to this, to this group that you need to make sure. And I think I almost got caught up into that because of the whole, you know, XOM, XOM, XOM. But the XOL members have a lot to offer. I mean, it's, it's apparent, right? It's apparent that they would have so much to offer in the group. And Luhan is another one who I think I've slept on. Uh, Lei was one as well as Tao. You know what I mean? But I'm glad, I'm glad that I was taught to make sure you, and there were times that I slipped because I forget like, oh wow, that's right. There are moments where you're not all 12. Like, I gotta remember that. I gotta remember that, so make sure. And, and we will be getting into the, mem like you see me do lace, so you'll see me get into those, those members as well. So I haven't forgotten about them, okay? All right. This one I saw. This is my boy right here. I'm not even gonna say nothing during this because I love it. I might rewind, of course, though.
love Kung Fu, man. The, the moves are so beautiful, like ballet dancing. Look at that gutted boy. I like this right here, the sweep. And then he stops. That shit is sick. Don't fuck with Tao. <laughs> and it's crazy because there's members, I think there's a couple of members in EXO. There's a couple in, there's who, somebody in BTS, that's Taekwondo, I believe. Somebody in NCT, or one or two of them, I think, in NCT. Uh, but yeah, they're all over the place. These guys have that hidden talent. You know what I mean? Unless you don't, if you don't know anything, you're not paying attention or you're not digging deep into these groups, you don't know. These dudes, man, they, there's that one dude in the group, you do something wrong, you might get your, you might get your, your, your teeth kicked out. Okay, let's fast forward to that. She's my baby. Oh, so this is the dance perform. Okay, this is just him. No camera change. I really need to make a new playlist, man. My shit is old. I go in the car and I'm like, how come I'm not playing more my EXO? How come I'm not playing more my NCT? How come I'm not playing my BT? I gotta really update my shit. Like seriously, tonight I think I'm gonna go into SoundCloud and make me an entire list. And I got to because I told you guys, within this year, within this year, we're gonna have the, um, the radio station back up. And there's gonna be a mix between K-pop and hip-hop. Okay, so, and I don't know what, the, it's basically gonna be called, it was called Infinity Corner Radio. Um, I may keep that or I may just call it, you know, um, Temple Radio, which is, I think is what I'm, you may still see it as Infinity Corner Radio. I don't know, I have to look at my account and see if I can change that name. But I think I'm gonna call, I think it's gonna be changed. It's gonna be called Temple Radio. You guys on YouTube, make sure you stay tuned. People on Facebook already know they're tuned into Infinity Corner Radio. They know what's up. I've had it shut down since I moved because I had a lot of other stuff to focus on. But I really, and I've played some K-pop stuff on there, very random, but the more stuff that I'm coming into, the more I wanna get it out there and get the heads that I know to like really appreciate some of this stuff. <laughs> nice little Michael Jackson. Uh, look at <laughs> look how Kai walked off there with the drunken monk style. Like yeah. I don't even have to say who I am. You know who I am. Look at him. Yeah. Oh, what? Punk ass mother. <laughs> that is the my smart kid right there. I love that dude. All right, next. Kai again. <laughs> oh, yeah, Kai again. So, I, I, did I say this in the beginning? I heard that Kai was in most of these because he's the main dancer or the first who was in EXO, I believe, something like that. So it had something to do with Kai being either the main or the first, and so they, they showcased him a lot in these. Um, and me and Kryn had the conversation about this. A lot of it kind of <laughs> just jumbled in there, but I do remember her telling me this. That shirt is insane. You wear clothing that will accent 
your dance moves. He pumps his chest out in little fringes, just like, whoosh, puts a big effect on that move. Like highlights his movements, look at that. Crumping, that is, he's straight crump style in his in his choreography. And it, I don't think it's full crump. I think he's got like the freestyle. He's got maybe must, you know, uh, some of the moves from whatever other choreography he's done. Plus the crump style, like he's thrown, it's like throwing everything in there. You know what I mean? <laughs> Toss salad. So many different aspects of dance in there. Kai is a badass. Look at him. <laughs> at least that's the, the the vibe he gives off there. Kai again. Special effects. I want to do stuff like that, man. Like just, you know, like, <laughs> you know what I mean? Like stuff like that. I want to do stuff like that. <laughs> like I want to do stuff like that. Look at that! Boy. I love that, man. The moves, like the house and the b-boy up rocks, man. Yeah, and you. And I've said, I've said before how like B-boys, when you look at B-boys, look, pay really close attention to the way B-boys dance and look at all the different forms of dance that are in there and how they manipulate, twist, turn, evolve, whatever words you want to do, elevate it, you know what I mean, improve on it, add to it, change it up you know, throw more dynamic into it. Like, it's just like watching this, I see, like, that's why I tell people, like, you gotta really be, you have to really look at all the dances and see the essence of the, the b-boy and look at, like, look at, you'll see all these different, you know, uh, styles of dance within it. It's all in there. And he reminds me, if you guys ever seen, there's a b-boy named Cloud. I think I've mentioned him before. You guys got to check him out. He's been like on Shakira's joint. And the way he dances, Kai straight reminds me of him because he doesn't dance like the tr traditional b-boy. He has this same style of dance to it where it's just like, boom, fluent contemporary moves. You know, the jazz joint that you don't see, you don't see a lot of these cats do. And he kills it. the way these special effects accent his movements. <laughs> so it's such short dances. Say hoon and Kai.
Morning car. Nice. Black Briar, remember this song? I love this song. I, I watched that joint with uh, Stevie Oki, Lay, Will I Am, and I was, I, again, when I watched the group as a whole dance, like, I was able to pick out a few. Kai, um, I thought Dio was very good. Uh, who is it? Um, Big Hyun. Um, and I know they're all great dancers, but I'd only got to see, like, a few at a time, you know what I mean, do their thing. Even during the guys, I don't think I kind of got the just of each individual member as far as the dancing goes. So it's dope to like see, it's dope to see, see this because I get even more impressed by the dancing of some of the guys who I didn't get a chance to dance, uh, see and lay in that video that I saw with him was dope. I mean, I was really shocked because I'd never really t was tuned into the like. And again, this is one of the Chinese members who um, I, I slept on because, again, I wasn't tuned in. I knew who they were, but I wasn't tuned in because it seemed like more the focus was XOM and nobody's fault but mine. But, you know, it, it's good. That's why. And when some people even gave me slack about even giving the Chinese members even attention, you know, I had maybe one or two people like, well, they're not in the group anymore doesn't matter like they were still part of the group and and I know for a fact from all of the from the little bit of research I have done that the EXO members still consider them part of EXO even though they're not there SM might not agree with that but the fact that the other members do means they have to be respected because you have to respect the group if you're if if you feel a certain way then that's you you can't impose that feeling on anybody else you know what I mean and I feel bad for the members because they've had to go through that kind of thing. You know what I mean? I can't even imagine. Like, but then again, I also feel for those, uh, for the Chinese members who've had to leave because they've had to do things. And now I hear like these guys are doing, gr I mean, great things, greater than what they would have probably achieved with SM, sticking behind SM and having to like follow these rules and restrictions. You know what I mean? You got to break free of the chains, especially if you feel like a slave. And if that's how they felt, then more power to them for leaving. Like, you can't be held down. And most of these people are pissed off at SM for the way they treat their artists anyway. So do you blame them? Like, we don't know the intent. We don't know the, the, the in-depth story behind why these guys left, other than what people told us on news articles or whatever. You know what I mean? And, and, who knows how much information they gave out if they did speak out about it. You know what I mean? I think it's just something that's personal. It happens. Shit happens. And you just got to ride with it. You know what I mean? But it, it's my fault for not putting that because I see, when I see an EXO, especially from the start, I kept seeing 12. I, kept, I forgot that there was nine. So I wasn't doing, I wasn't thinking XOM, XO, 
uh, XOK, XOM, XOM, XOK. I was just seeing XO. And then, I, hey, why is there only nine members? Oh, I forgot, that's right. Uh, three of them left. And so, and nothing, again, nothing bad, but when I, when I did the, I did, I think it was the guides or something, and there was no guide for Luhan, Lei, or, or Tao, I did find one that maybe not have been as accurate as some, but at least it was, it was something. You know what I mean? It was something. So I appreciated that. And people was like, well, I don't know why you did a guy for them. They're not part of the group no more. Who gives a fuck? I know they're not part of the group anymore. But they were. And because I'm this far back, before the point in which there was only nine, then I have to, this is, it, it, I have to do this. Because I need to know why. I need to know where it started, midpoint, and then future. So I, I got to see that. And then, of course, yeah, I'm going to dig in and see what's going on with those three members, too. Because, I mean, I do like the entire group. So, I mean, you know, it is what it is. on beat. Nice pyrotex. Nice pyrotex. Let out the beast. Beast mode. <laughs> Now what? Get out the car. Get out the car, fool. <laughs> oh, Eclipse cut your electricity off. It's crazy because when I see that symbol right there, it's almost... It, it's nostalgic in a sense because that was the first symbol when I made the intro for EXO. I was like, I need something like boom. So when I see that symbol, it's nostalgic. It, it, it actually, in a sense, it's like um, it, uh, it, it kind of it brings like a little bit of an emotional like impact when I see it because that's it's like damn that's this is where it all started. <laughs> it's, it's dope. I look at that like damn that's where it all started. love and the names are at the bottom <laughs> Wait a minute. I thought that was 
seen. playlist up to date oh okay i'm down to watch it again <laughs> i'm down to watch it again girl i can't explain what i feel I'm sorry, I'm not trying to take away from the dance, but this is my first, this is the shit. I thought Monster was the one. This is the joint that got me on the vocals. This shit right here, I was like, uh-uh. <laughs> I swear to God, I'm sorry, I'm, I'm humming. I don't know the words. If I didn't do the words, I'd have been. You wouldn't even heard this. I'd be. I love this. <laughs> So he comes in later. Ah, I show how I started. Okay. Nice. I like the way they played that out. That was dope. <laughs> Sorry for singing, but. Tao again, I remember this fight scene right here. It's shit is going. Alright, 
right, we're gonna freeze it. We're gonna freeze it right there. I don't know how many that was. Let me see, I'm not sure how many that was, but that was dope. We'll, we'll walk, don't worry, we'll do a second part. Love those joints. I'm kinda, I'm tempted to do, them, to do them all. I'm tempted to do them all, but you know what? We'll do a second part. I told you, I like to spread things out, man. I like to spread them out, so. Very nice, very nice EXO. Y'all know what's going down. Subscribe, like, share. Leave your comments below. Let's grow together, share knowledge, and build community, okay? Until the next time, I'll see y'all later. Peace. Any spot getting plenty props Cause I'm weak alley any hot Till my body rides And running up I spray them down Like the body shop Finger bangs Just hit with four fingers Like karate chop I'm bragging more than you imagine To the non-factors and sagging Cause we still and Spelling everything backwards Sometimes I forget lines Like gold-plated actors So I guzzle a 50 act Till I regurgitate